today I'd like to talk to you about color palettes for condos. In today's housing market, there is a glut of condos. One of the issues that happens with a condo is unfortunately that many of them look very much the same. There is no way to add punch to it with things like a deck or a fancy front door. What you need to be able to do is take your space and be able to personalize it because so much of what goes inside of a condo is bleak and drab and open concept. What I recommend doing is picking a very uniform color that you can run out through the entire color scheme and using a tone on tone look with a lighter shade of the same color on your trim or your ceiling. Now inside of each room, once you get past the open concept such as bedrooms, dens or bathrooms, what I like to do is add punch. This can be something as simple as taking accent colors and putting up an accent wall, or you can involve painting your furniture. Using Paris Forecast colors, you're able to find the latest, hottest trends in the colors that are available. Things we recommend are purples that have a slight gray undertone, so they're muted and work with the other colors that you have up. Burnt oranges are very popular to add some life to a den. Greens are very popular for people looking for an earthy feel, and indigo blue has come back very much in fashion. Now you don't need to put this throughout your whole condo so that it feels that it's overwhelming and turns off buyers, but what you need to do is be able to say in a crowded condo market that I've found a way to differentiate and make my condo stand out from that that other people will be seeing. By doing this, buyers will look at this and give you a yes instead of a no on what would be just an open concept condo that are hundreds and hundreds of available in today's housing market.